In the 1980s, Remax was unknown in Canada. Um, they were a startup. There was, you know, um, a handful of offices and, and a few hundred agents that were working. So nobody knew who they were in Canada. When I joined them in 1984, the company had reached about 900 agents. But I knew that there was something there. I could sense there was something there, that it was growing, it was vibrant, it was electric. It was a tough go in the early days, there's no question about that, because people would call the name they recognized, the name they saw on the signs all around the neighborhood. We often got called in, you know, they think they would call us in for a second opinion, and then they'd be totally blown away by what they saw when we came in the door. But Remax helped us, they guided us with a lot of material to go through the door and come off looking very professional. You add to that a little bit of experience, a lot of youth, a lot of energy, and people really liked it. So within three years, that company grew to become the number one organization in all of Canada. It was just a tremendous growth spurt. An outrageous amount of uh, activity happened in the company in that time. And the way they did that was by basically pulling away the top producers. In essence, Remax drained all of the other companies of their top people. And from there, they built offices and offices and offices of top producing agents, and our market share just skyrocketed. And it was at that point when the streets were virtually littered with Remax sold signs. And the group of people that were at Remax in Canada were very dynamic people, and everybody mingled and intermingled and, and got to know each other well. So we had things like baseball teams, hockey teams, bowling leagues, all kinds of stuff were going on at that time, and, and everybody was enjoying everybody's company. It was an amazing time to be part of that organization. And we have a lot of time ahead of us in this company. I really think that Remax has everything in place to stay in the number one position.